Oh, hi. Welcome back to Video Game Repair Corner. On this uh, episode, we are going to be showing you how to swap out a power board from an original Xbox. Let's take a look. All right, so in the last episode, we showed you how to pop the top off an Xbox. There's just a couple screws here, there, and there, you know. You just gotta rip her off there. Be careful, it's a nice green, shiny one. Well, what you want for the job is the right tool. So right here, we're gonna take out the wires here so we're gonna be able to get down at this box here. The and then we're gonna- on my workbench? Jesus. Oh, just yeah, borrowing a video game shit uh, again? They're just borrowing it for a second. We're uh, switching the uh, power board out of an Xbox. I know, you. You're not the only one who likes to play video game. Use this big ass screen. Jeez. Grumpy guy. Grumpy. Uh, that's that's the Bobcat. Sorry, Bobcat, to disturb your bench. Suckers. All right. So what we're gonna do here is just pop this right off and get down to our power board, which we can see right down here. We got one already pulled out for you to look at. That's the one we're gonna be putting in there. Nice new fresh one. So after you got that done, you're just gonna to wanna to pull these out here. And then, oh, jeez, got a little uh, little shock there. You're gonna to wanna to make sure your power bar is off. What the f All right, so what we got here is our power board now exposed and there's just a couple of uh, screws we're gonna to wanna to take out here. It's just one here, and then there's gonna be one on the other side. And it's very important that you have the power off during this stage, because you don't wanna get zapped. And make sure you don't lose these little guys, because that's a real pain in the butt to try and replace when you wanna put your PlayStation back together. So pretty much everything's ready to go here. I'm just gonna put my hands right in here and pull it out. <laughs> Is this this is this has been video game repair corner. 